What's up ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Lingo Reacts, Coop over here, as is always, and we got more BTS, and it is going to be a Lingo React session. As you know, we're always the hip-hop heads trying to learn more about K-pop. It, it's always been that, this YouTube channel has always been like that, and today we have We Are Bulletproof, The Eternal. Sounds very grim? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what to expect. I don't know what to expect because so far this album has given us so many different looks. Every so many different looks. Different. Like, I mean, from On to Black Swan to like the song we just listened yeah. to. There's so much that is different between every single song that you really don't know what to expect from Map of the Soul 7. And uh, we're kind of going through the journey with it with you guys. As always, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification button. Ding, ding, ding. 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 And also, we have other things as uh, different from Lingo Reacts as well. We make sports videos talking about the UFC, the NBA, and pretty much any other sport you could imagine. And we react to news as well, so make sure to check out those playlists as well. They'll be somewhere in this video. And uh, let's get right into it. It's not going to be... Do you think it's going to be better than... Uh, louder than the bombs I sing? So far, that's my best chorus okay. so um, I have high expectations we'll see. Okay, let's see. This is with all of them, I I yes. hope. Yeah. I J Hope. I you J Hope. Uh, and and I RM. No that doesn't make sense. It makes no sense bro. <laughs> So there's obvious use of autotune. What I see is that they use it as an instrument instead of a vocal uh, enhancer. Vocal enhancer, yeah. Because you see that they already have the vocals. They can sing this live without any any like issues. Yeah. Right? But they use it as an instrument to enhance their music. Mm -hmm. And from what I see, it's also um, going off the trends that we see in Western eyes. Culture. Pop and yeah. Everything, yeah. You know? um, I want to talk about the number seven. Because obviously the Map of the Soul 7, the album, mm -hmm. uh, they've been together for seven years, seven members seven of members. the group. Uh, seven is really important to them, but they just mentioned something really interesting too. It's like, we've gone through seven falls, we've gone through seven springs, seven winters, and we finally got to heaven. Um, I guess is, maybe this album is representing heaven to them. I actually, I, I was going to mention, think? Uh, yes, in a sense, but I also think... Um, there is a lot of things to do with the number seven and heaven in religion, in uh, mythology. Oh, seven, seven, yeah, seven heaven, right? It's very, very seven uh, minutes in heaven. Seven minutes in heaven. No, it's related. Genuinely, it's like it's one of the most important numbers in numerology, if you want to say it. And uh, I don't, I don't know if they did that on purpose. I'm sure they did because BTS is always more more creative than any other artist out there. Uh, but it's just a cool thing that I thought I realized. Mm -hmm. It's like, hmm, they're they're actually referencing there's always so, so much more deep meaning to the number seven than you could even imagine yeah and i know that in like asian culture maybe even like korean culture um numbers is a big thing yeah numerology is huge yeah yeah for sure even like in um asian culture like south asian culture like indians and everything like we mm -hmm. have numerology as something that is a very big deal yeah so I'm not too sure about how it is for Koreans, but I believe that maybe it's probably a big deal too. Yeah, numbers, numbers in every culture is very important. You know, yeah. the, the the significance of of numbers, certain numbers are bad, certain numbers are good. Mm -hmm. Seven is a very good number. It's it's a very lucky number, pretty generally. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, so it was interesting that they use this map of the Soul Seven. That's just another concept, just something to think about. I'm 
so far what the song is meaning is that they're showing their progress progression after the seven years yeah i can see right? that. Yeah. and it's showing that the seven of them together they feel like they're bulletproof and they finally gain the acceptance of all their audience that makes sense that's what i feel like that they're saying throughout this song no that makes a lot of sense and and it seems like you know like they've worked so hard to finally get to this point where everyone they finally accepted them. reached to that yeah yeah, that makes a lot of sense. And, and they, that's, like, that's why they're saying, yeah, and we that got to heaven. them is heaven. Exactly. You know? Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. I hope we're good. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, man. <laughs> Soul's trying to trick us. Listen, um, I, I think the coolest part about that was the the different meanings behind it. I probably say that's that's the most. I don't mm. want to say it's the most meaningful song on the album, but I I could argue that's the most meaningful song to them as a group. I feel like that song was really speaking about their own journey mm -hmm. and uh, what they feel like the number seven of Map of the Soul Seven means to them yeah. to their fans. Yeah, absolutely, right. and and it. it it's, it seems like they're saying that with their fans now, they feel like they're invincible. Like, they feel like they're bulletproof. They, yeah, feel, like, they feel like they finally have you. Mm -hmm. You know, like, the, like, they keep saying, we have you. Yeah. You know, we're now in heaven. Yeah. And we are not seven with you. He's, it's, they're essentially saying that it's not just us on this journey. It's every BTS fan, every BTS army yes. member that's part of it, which is really, really cool. I loved it. This guy needs to stop tricking us into trying to listen to his song. Yeah, I don't want to listen to your songs, but I just want BTS. <laughs> Yo, what's up? Thanks for watching our video, and if you haven't already, like, comment, and subscribe, and watch our other videos. Pick them, pick them right there. 